Welcome back to Graphic Island Tutorial. In today's video, we'll develop a business card. So first, let's do page setup. You can create a new page from here or you can go to File, New. And here you can give the width and the height of the uh, business card. So instead of pixel, uh, select inches. This is the standard format for business card. And here give 3.2 and for height give 2 inches and here instead of one artboard give 2 because we need uh, front and back of the business card and now click on create so we we made two artboard here and now from the toolbar select this rectangular tool and draw a rectangle here and choose color and for this also draw another rectangle here and you can ch uh, check with different color no problem now select them and remove the outlines let's work on the first artboard so you can zoom it and now from the toolbar select this pen tool and draw a line with some angle now select this one edit copy edit paste in place select this one and change the color and now select this line by pressing shift key so after selection of both line and this rectangle take this shape builder tool by pressing alt key on your keyboard just delete this portion and now delete this line now from the toolbar select this rectangular tool once again and here draw a rectangle up to up to here and let me fill this new rect rectangle with color now take this direct selection tool select this anchor point and this anchor point by pressing shift key and now drag it after dragging it you need to unite it so that it should be unite with the remaining part of the rectangle now take rectangular tool and draw a rectangle from here to here now drag this rectangle by pressing alt key on your keyboard and by ma making this much of gap release it here and make duplicate and now control D and repeat it now select this one this one this one this one this and this by pressing shift key on your keyboard and unite it from here and uh, here draw a rectangle from here to here now let's use some details on our business card here i'm having some ready-made details so i'll use those details to the business card so let me take this one to the business card page and uh, here i'll use one barcode and let me use some social media icon
so I'll use this logo let me take to our business card page and let me place this logo here select it and align it to center and now drag this one by pressing alt key on your keyboard and make duplicate and drag it and make little bit smaller in size and place it here now let's change the color For this one, let me check with red color. From the toolbar, select this ellipse tool and draw a circle here. And change the circle color to white. and place it perfectly at the middle now select this one drag it by pressing alt key and make duplicate and now control D and repeat it take this one little bit up this one up now by using text tool write text here services and you can change the font from here now change the color Now drag it by pressing Alt key and make duplicate and place it at the middle. Now Control D and repeat. I'll select this and choose this color and for this I'll select this blue color now select this one by pressing alt key make duplicate and now drag it down by pressing shift and alt key on your keyboard and make little bit smaller in size and place it here now from here reduce the capacity give 15 enter now select it and drag it by pressing alt and shift key and make duplicate now control d and repeat this duplicate select them by pressing shift key and place them at the middle drag it down by pressing alt key on your keyboard and place here at the middle and make duplicate and place it here now select them and unselect this by pressing shift key and now drag it once more and place it here now select this do right click and take it to the front similarly select this one do right click and bring it to front and now bring this one and place it here and do right click 
and arrange it to front and choose color from here now let's place this barcode here let's save this front and back of the business card in png24 transparent so that we can apply it for mockup so select this artboard go to file export save for web and here make sure you mark png24 and transparency and here i'll increase the percentage because we need the export files is little bit bigger so that it can perfectly fit on our mockup and now you can fit on the screen and click on save and here give front and save it similarly select this artboard select means just click over this artboard this artboard will automatically select it and when you'll go to file export you will see only uh, this artboard file will be shown for the save so click on save for web and again keep those things same and give 450 again and now you can fit on the screen and save it this time give back because this is the back of the business card and save it so after saving those front and back of the business card in png24 transparent now we need to open our photoshop so from here open your photoshop open those transparent file and the mockup file so this is the back and front of the business card so just open it after opening those two files again go to file open and open your mockup file and open your mockup file now in place of front we need to place our front of the business card so double click here and now here is the front of the business card so drag it to this layer and place it here and now mark it unmark this background and close this tab click on yes and wait for the mockup to be applied now let's check the result similarly click here and let's drag it and place it here and fit it perfectly and now mark it unmark those background and close it click on yes now let's check the result hope you like this tutorial you can subscribe and support our channel thank you